Why are people killing each other over social media and drill rap? Well, because what happens is it's called uh, respect. So what happens is when you disrespect somebody on social media, or, you know, we call that social media gang banging, or through a rap song, then you must respond to it. If you don't respond to it, then you're going to be looked upon as weak. Excuse me. Uh-huh. All right, this is mine. This Reek Bleak. This Reek Bleak. And who else? Who else? I'm gonna put big ass in there right now. Excuse me, Excuse me. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. We can name about five more. <laughs> now, as we gone over in previous videos, No Savage going on live in 2020 would start one of the biggest beefs in DC rap history. This would lead Cruddy Murder in the Paradise Neighborhood in the start of 2021 to diss 37 and link up with Simple City. No Savage at this time was underhanded as his regular security team of the Yo to the Blow was either locked up or passed away. This would lead No Savage to turn to popular producer Chicho and link up with the Lincoln Heights Youngins and morally rich Jake. But Jake was not ready for Paradise as his chain would be snatched within weeks. All day, y'all. Look, that thing swinging. Like, that thing's gonna be out here all day, man. This would lead No Savage to go back to Southeast and link up with old friends. JG Riff, who's an old friend of No Savage, is from Trenton Park, and he had his fair share of rap beefs. When Savage probably asked how he handled all his beefs, he had to look no further than J.G. Wardy, another rapper from Trenton Park. Now when some of No Savage security was finally free, Wardy would take this chance to start Fox 5 Gang. Let me introduce myself. They call me Wardy High. AK in an auto cop. AK run through your block. AK Big Fox Swag Gang. JG started down. AK Big Fast Yeah. We got Drizzy on deck. After linking up with 37, Wardy would form one of the most feared rap groups in the DMV. After No Savage was locked up, him being the only real rapper from the group, Wardy and Fox 5 Gang would take over the vacant spot at the top of the DMV music scene. Bitch niggas ain't on none, we on these bitch niggas just be tough. We been sitting right here for way too long. If he run, nigga, you bad hawk. My young nigga only like 18, say I'm a cook and whoa, I ain't doing no I'm only fucking with them niggas that be sly. Bitch nigga, we the ones that's bringing this shit. We got these fuck niggas out here ducking it high. In all my years of listening to DMV rap, I've never seen a rapper respected like J.G. Wardy. I'ma curl you when I see you. Oh, okay, man, I'ma curl you when I, I see you. Listen, the mall, man, listen. I never I said you don't be on. Yeah, nigga never said you don't be doing nothing. Man, man, we, we just now, we don't have all that. I'ma give you the respect. Or, or for Nuri, if you still saving them, I'll leave them alone. If you ain't saving them, I'm hit the look, gas on his ass. Up. I'm about to hit the gas on his ass. That's like, like if you ain't saving them, like, I'm gonna hit the gas on his ass. Can I get the word that you ain't gonna protect high end? If you ain't gonna protect them, I'm on his ass. I'm about to hit the gas. That's my man. We cooled it. We cooled it, Mr. Hot. I could really make a whole video on how Wardy is feared in the streets of DC. Some in the Reddit have called Wardy undisciplined. I just want to know what has made Wardy so feared. Even Sneaky, who's known for going on all his ops on live, is left silent when dealing with Wardy. Who that skinny? That's that that nigga skinny. Call this broke ass skinny. That's the only nigga that be writing me. I'm about to go loud with y'all. I go loud with me, broke ass niggas. Go loud with me. Y'all scared of me, bitch. Hey, you scared, nigga? You scared of water? Like everybody here? Five two. Cause I ain't trying to go loud with me. Them niggas don't. Them niggas know not to show their face on. Them niggas know they know they know the type they were. They know not to say that shit out their motherfucking mouth.
Wardy somehow managed to get some of the biggest rappers in the DC area to come together. He even has them playing games in his couch. My young nigga up here really. Look. Look at his face. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Got my other uh, young nigga up here with me. Okay. A rapper who is often dissed in Fox 5 music is Brody Slime, friend of Cruddy Murder, who died in late 2021. I'm a motherfucking war general working this black. What about body? His ass got scrapped. I'm a punish or rip, then I'm on to the next. No, no, no. I can't say too much in this rap shit, but we the reason niggas ass getting hey, shit. Fuck every mind of my death. When I'm riding with score, you remind me of Steph. His rap friend got shot, he ain't these steps. Old head man got left on the step. Lil' bro ass got hit in his chest. Dre head shorty got hit in the neck. In the name of Brody, bitch, we step. That day come a soon, little nigga, this chest. In the name of what, when you gon' spend for that nigga? Nigga talk when they up on the score, nigga Jeff. Nigga Mike, I take that trip up north and go and spot my shot. Nigga don't tell me shit about the dice, we got that hood on lock. Nigga Fox, I gang, we stand on top of shit at MG Top. It wasn't until months later that Young Slime will give us some hints to why Brody is constantly dissed. Nigga long live Brody, paralyzed mother. Nigga fuck that bitch, she felt that cuff. You niggas ain't steppers, ain't step for your mother. Shit's going on, I'm in roof with my brother. Now, as you all know of my previous videos, Dripper 37th would pass away and rapper Young Slime would waste no time dropping a diss track on the day of his funeral. Yo, man, got left in the sack. got hit in his head, he got left in the bag. Money and murder, we spent get cash. I see him again and I'm dragging his ass. Why you rapping about shit you ain't do? He got crap in his head, he got time to the two. He got left in the diss, I'm just one of them Two minutes again, bitch, we coming for you. That wasn't the only thing dropped on this day as during a funeral, somebody was slide, killing one man. Before Wardy could respond, he was arrested after police blitzed his home and they found multiple different ghost guns and drugs. But it's the last thing they found that explains why Wardy is so feared and why he laughed at Mark Dog. Oh Wardy and his group were found with over $300,000 in cash. To put that into perspective, Semi Homie signed a music deal for $50,000. Even No Savage at his height point signed with 300 Entertainment for $150,000. And Wardy had more than both of them combined. But him getting locked up couldn't stop retaliation for linking up with Migo Lee and SEAL Team 6. As Kai Glock and CHV will respond by robbing an associate of 37. So then we take care of this bitch for him, Mo. Just let us get this motherfucker. We gonna take care of this jump for you. We got niggas hocks. Hop out with that whip on the pot. I be dragging my nuts back. Go ask the ox who act about really push it on that box. That's why I ain't on the bitch. I can't like you took a chain. No, you ain't do that, boy. You cap it. Young ass nigga really want some clout. Your bitch ass just a rap. Can't wait till I catch you. You know I'm a slap. It's like I'm a hit your dumb ass with this switch. A couple days after dropping that response, Gizwap would be arrested once again. With so many people locked up, their ops around the district would drop their disses. Fuck, fuck, hang, hang. Watch out, get on that cop. They shoot from the gates, they won't make it fall. He got hit by a test or he won't see the mob. Drink it, the blue and send him up to the star. You ain't put that 50 ball in that pee. I fuck with some Migos, but we don't know leave. We got through, I'm flipping that bitch. Earth drip, try spinning, got pushed out the wheel. I'm dragging my knuckles, I'm banging my stick. I'ma hop on the car, hit him right in his face. Dig deep in the line, put drink through the gate. PZ, when we try to run, you get checked. I didn't draw where he lived from a bitch to escape. I'm creeping the gig, and you know how it is. Around the same time, popular rapper Money Mar was arrested from a 2021 fentanyl overdose. Now it seemed him and Cruddy Murder were heavily locked in, and they both were arrested on this charge. 
with another artist who is already incarcerated, but the one that we don't know about right now is Cruddy Murder. Damn, the homie got locked up. Damn. Even Sneaky Bands was arrested and put in DC jail, where it's rumored he was stabbed. With so many rappers from both sides being locked up, even a notorious piece of face is hopped in the booth. This ain't no shit. We the ones hopping out, going rip the rich. I spend on my rip, now I'm smoking on drinks. You speak up and stuff, and I'm coming with switch. Kind Fox, but I get clip. Uh, smoking on all you got laid by a bitch. Niggas, they ain't no shit. Uh, all summer drinking my nuts on they rip. Could this be an end to the ongoing beef in DC? Or could this be a start to something worse? Yeah, yeah.